Many years ago, I think I was a teenager at the time, a word popped up into my mind. It's funny, I can remember that word years later, but it had very little meaning at the time. The word was, just one word, unity. Funny thing happened, many years later I joined the Navy at 18, got some tattoos, and one of the tattoos on it said the word unity. This was, of course, uniting three different nations with their flags and symbols and the word unity written under it. Still never meant much. Now I'm an old man and I realise what unity really means. Unity means the United, not the United States, the United People of the whole world. Why do I say that? Because we're all the same. We all have in this business of uh, I am. I am alive. I am an experiencer. I am here. Everyone's got that. And that is uniform to every person. And yet every person thinks that they are unique and stand apart and we are not really united. Our bodies end in one in a certain dimension. We're born into this world alone and we die alone. That's what we think because we identify completely with our physical bodies. Not realizing, of course, that they are, these are a bit like a transportation system, like a car. We are in the car, we are not the car. If the car dissolves around us, we are still there. So what is still there? This I am, this me, this consciousness that knows itself to be. And it's the same in all of us. All of us. Because it is one. It is unity. The united consciousness of the human race doesn't depend upon our bodies, doesn't depend upon our knowledge, doesn't depend upon anything. It is. Everything depends upon what it is. Everything comes out of, evolves from, precipitates out of, is born of the consciousness that we are. 